New tonight, the North Carolina Courage soccer team celebrating pride. It was the first ever pride night at Wake Med Soccer Park. There were dozens of LGBTQ plus vendors, live entertainment and food trucks, but one player wanted no parts in the celebration, causing a little controversy. Joel Brown joins us live from Cary to explain this one. Hi, Joel. Yeah, Lauren, Steve, look, there was a backlash here last December when the Courage coaxed Jaylene Daniels out of retirement. That signing upset a lot of fans because of Daniels' opposition to gay rights. But the Courage apologized, and Daniels is still a part of this team until tonight because it's Pride Night. On stage outside Wake Med Soccer Park Friday night, a drag queen entertaining the crowd with locks laid out in the colors of pride. The NC Courage hosting the soccer team's first ever pride festival before kickoff. Fun games, a celebration of inclusion, minus the one Courage player who wanted no part of the festivities over pride. It is her opinion, and um, unfortunately, it might not align with mine and a lot of the fans here, but she's here. She's talking about Jaylene Daniels, the Courage defender who made news in 2017 when she declined to play on the women's national team, citing her Christian faith in opposition to wearing a rainbow-themed jersey. Tonight in Cary, Daniels did it again. In a statement, the team telling us Jaylene will not be rostered tonight as she has made the decision to not wear our pride jersey. While we are disappointed with her choice, we respect her right to make that decision for herself. And so the Courage took the field Friday in their special Pride Night jerseys, the numbers shaded in with the colors of pride and with no Daniels on the roster. Outside the soccer park. Well, we're going to show it for as long as we feel like is appropriate at the game. Victoria Vare scrawled her Daniels disapproval on poster board for the game. This is a clear example of her not being tolerant and yet we have LGBTQ plus players that have to be on this team with her day in and day out. How is their, their tolerance treated? As fans poured in toting pride flags, some waved off the controversy, others dismissive of Daniel's decision. She didn't need to be here then. Doesn't need to be here. No. If you don't want to be part of it, then don't be here. Any thoughts? Same. I support the team and their decision no matter what, and everyone's got their own beliefs. Um, we're just here to watch soccer. Just here to watch soccer. Despite the controversy, the Courage went on to say in its statement that it is excited to celebrate the LGBTQI plus community with fans, players, and staff, and looks forward to hosting its Pride Festival. And from the looks of things this afternoon and this evening, people really seem to enjoy it, even amidst the dust up over Daniels. Stephen Lauren, by the way, game ended 3-3 tie with the Washington Spirit tonight. All right, Joel Brown, thank you for that update.